Hi everybody and welcome to this tutorial where we are going to draw a soap bubble. So I will explain how this is done. What you need are some colored pencil, maybe you have a blender stick or you can just use your finger to rub in the pigments a little bit. And you also need a little tiny ball rounded that will help you for the first setup. And you will also need black paper. Now this is a scrapbook, a photo scrapbook, and that has a very smooth black paper. So ideal and very cheap indeed. First I've drawn a round, around that little cup. And then I'm choosing the color light green for the first circle. And I just draw that in in the way of the bubble itself. So I don't go crisscross, but I draw along with the roundness of the first circle. Then I put in a little bit of pink. I draw just through the edge of that bubble and I simply place in some areas where I want the colors to be in. Then I'm taking a dark blue. I think that would look nice on the bottom part of that bubble. So I simply draw this in. And these are pastel pencils of course, but you can also try this out with your standard color pencils. Let's try a little bit of yellow. Now imagine that the sun is out there in the sky and it is casting a little bit of light on that soap bubble. So for the top of the bu bubble, I'm using just a little bit of yellow. As you can see, I keep drawing around it and then I simply rub the pigments in a little bit with my finger. Let's try some white. Now the white is for the real highlights on that soap bubble. So I place in a little bit of white and then softly rub it in with my finger. I also do that on the left side of the bubble. Here on the edge I also draw in a little bit of white. I want to get that bubble to look rounded. Hmm. Okay, this is starting to look rather rounded. Uh, let's try out some blue. The light blue I use uh, also on the top of the bubble. So the lower part is a little bit darker than the top part. I also put it in a little bit on the left side. Now, this is a very nice tip indeed. When you take your black pencil, you can see that the black from the pigments is a little bit darker than the paper itself. So I use the black for the inside of the bubble. I put in a little bit of pigment and then I rub it in. Then I take a look and I think it needs a little bit more black. Okay, that's better. Now let's put in some dots. The dots will help you to make your bubble appear more rounded and you can also draw in some flashy lights that are casted off that bubble. 
Now this gives a, a very awesome effect. Just put in some tiny stripes. Like the light is casted away from that bubble. And then I put in a little bit of extra yellow for extra shine. Now my bubble is almost finished. I draw in a little bit of extra black for the inside of the bubble and then my drawing is done. Well, I hope you enjoyed it and that you will give this a try. It is very much fun to do. If you like this video, please give it a like, share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe. I will see you again in my next tutorial.